doesn't have a filing cabinet sitting at your house or at work. They're everywhere and they're not a pretty thing. But that doesn't have to be the case. For this morning's DIY Danielle, it is a filing cabinet face off with the one and only Tessa Mentis. So Tessa and I both have these really sad, old looking filing cabinets sitting at our desks. They're rough. And Tessa said, why don't we DIY a filing cabinet? And I know that Tessa has her own DIY abilities. So I said, girl, you're on your own. I'm gonna do mine and you're gonna do yours and we'll see who reigns supreme. I'm just gonna say you're starting out a little ahead of me because <laughs> okay, mine isn't even attached. <laughs> All right, we're gonna see. We're gonna take these things out back and try and get to work on it. You ready? I, as I'll ever be. Okay, my friend. let's do it. First up, we had to give them a good cleaning. These things are at least 15 years old. Anybody remember the reporter Greg Gourule? Tessa scraped his business card off the filing cabinet. Uh, we used goof off to get the gunk off and a razor blade scraped the rest. My plan okay. is to use some wood, rustic wood look contact paper nice. on the front, on the drawer fronts, okay. maybe the sides, some black trim, and I'm adding wheels. All right, what are you doing? What am I not doing? <laughs> Every side is different. So mine's gonna be much more eccentric, I think. Yeah. Mine's very interactive. That is, it's like a Meow Wolf cabinet. Yes! The foundation for both plans, black spray paint. And now it's a bicep, bicep. Mm -hmm. Like the shake weight, remember that thing? <laughs> how, how could we forget it? That was controversial. We should probably have masks on. Yep, don't do this without a mask. Oh, T, you're right in my line of fire, buddy. These cabinets just took one can of spray paint each. Then for mine, I popped off the label holders and unscrewed the handles before applying my sticky contact paper to the drawer fronts. With the wrapper still somewhat on the contact paper and then start smoothing as you go. And then once we smooth out the bubbles, we will push more, pull the wrapper off more. I just used an old plastic card to smooth it out. Then I used an X-Acto knife to cut holes where the hardware goes and trimmed the excess after wrapping it around the sides. Then I trimmed some metal corner brackets with tin snips and glued them onto the drawers. Now be aware, this made it so the drawers don't close all the way anymore. Then I attached on the handles and secured wheels to the bottom. We have the wheel, we have the washers, one washer on this side, one washer on that side. And then the nut on top holds it on. We're gonna ratchet it on real tight. Do you want it there? Do you want it over there? All right, time to check on Tessa. She attached a large map printout of New Mexico to the drawers, applying Mod Podge, then smoothing with a razor blade. She sealed it with a top coat of spray adhesive. Then she mod podged a gallery of black and white photos of iconic New Mexico imagery to the side. Biscochitos. So you had all this. Chevelle. My bestie. Despite a glue accident, ah! it turned out great. Tessa wheeled her cabinet inside but she had to finish all the sides throughout the week. A tribute to the Pueblos on one side, an iconic Spanish window on the back, a cushion on the top, chili pepper handles. It is amazing. And so our boss had the wise idea to put a poll on Facebook and ask you which <laughs> one you like the best. So after the morning show's over, go to our KOB Facebook page, vote for your favorite. We know Tessa's gonna win. But no, actually, I, I don't like know. yours, because yours is more simple. Mine's hers very is simple. very eclectic. Yeah. You know? and very a whole, busy. A whole new idea on each side. Yeah. Yeah, so we'll reveal the winner in our 6.30 newscast this evening. Yeah, and yours also has that nice rustic, it just looks nice. It looks clean. Y'all are good <laughs> Not to as me. busy. <laughs> yeah, we're not sucking up to you. We don't say that we didn't like you. I paid them to say that. No, 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 no.